something's going very right at La Perla because year to date your sales are up double digits, 30 percent worldwide, and you said even this month they are accelerating. What's happening? Um, as of a year ago, we were bought by a new company, Pacific Global Management out of London, and there's just been you know, quite an investment across the board in elevating the brand. So it's new ad campaign and marketing that is really um, something that we haven't seen in the last five to six years, renovating our store, making sure our boutique environment is really elevated and consistent with what you see from the iconic luxury brands. We want to be sitting in that company and we want that customer experience, and also in the product. We've taken the product up and the customer is responsible and we see it in sales. Talk to me a little bit about more that it's sort of counterintuitive that you could raise your prices and demand spikes, although we've seen a lot of luxury brands do it. I'm thinking of Bottega Veneta, perhaps, or even Louis Vuitton. They've been raising prices and it seems to be working. You now uh, have corsets that cost $50,000. How big is the demand really for multi-thousand dollar corsets? Well, you would be surprised. I mean, as, as our new ownership has, again, committed to taking the brand up in every way, you know, we launched, for example, Made to Measure, which, you know, some of the items are have 14 karat gold thread in the lace, and the fabrics are the best you can find. The laces are um, produced and cut only for La Perla. And some of the Made to Measure items require 30 measurements and take months to make. Mm -hmm. So there is a customer that wants that sartorial, custom-made experience and we're, we want to make sure that we cater to them and it's really a global luxury traveler um, and client that we see traveling through the Middle East through the UK and also through the US and our top doors um, and that customer is looking for that experience and we want to make sure that we're providing it. Is that How old is that customer? Is that customer uh, a young woman who's splurging on lingerie? Is it a middle-aged woman who has plenty of money? Uh, is it American women? I know you're selling in the US but are you selling in the US to Americans or is it perhaps men uh, who are looking looking to spend a couple thousand dollars on a corset. Well, I mean, we do sell to men and we do have a gift giving business, but really our core, the DNA of the brand is about women who are com confident and buying for themselves. And interestingly, when you ask about age, we just did some research at the company. And when you look at the fastest growing part of our business, it is a younger customer. And certainly our core business is that 30 to 45 range, which, you know, in the end, that really speaks well to bringing new younger customers to the brand, but also our core customer um, and our highest average transaction customer is still what I would consider pretty young. So, um, so again, you would think when you look at really luxury and top spending habits, sometimes it's a more mature client. But at La Perla, we're also bringing younger clients into the brand. Uh, and you're also getting into men's clothes. La Perla, of course, uh, is an Italian label known for very luxurious lace, uh, for corsets, for garter belts, uh, you know, lovely, elegant silk bras, that kind of thing. What is the menswear line going to look like? It's really part of our growth strategy, and if you look at um, a lot of research and what people are talking about, the men's business is an important part of the luxury market long term, and our ownership group really saw that and wanted to make sure that we were participating in that business and we're building it for the long term. So we hired a creative director that really will specialize in men's. We launched at Pitiwomo in June, and the product is the finest fabrics. It does take inspiration from La Perla um, in certain So are we ways. talking boxers, briefs, or are we talking little silk shorts? Silk. <laughs> okay. Silk. Silk. Amazing fabric. Again, <laughs> back to the sartorial, the craftsmanship. Interesting. Um, so it's taking yeah. inspiration from La Perla, but building cool. on it. Susie, looking forward to seeing it. Susie Bazan, CEO of La Perla North America.